Hi, this is Grace Pamela with Summerana.com, and this is a preview and tutorial of the new Summerana Skies Overlay and Action Collection. This is available for both PS and PSE, and the image we are going to be working on today is this one. I have pulled up my Action Collection over here, and the first thing you want to do is go to Apply Summerana Sky and press Play. Next, you'll choose the sky that you want to add and press Place. Then you'll want to drag it up over your image, hold the shift key, and pull the corners out so that you can make it fit over your image. You want to put it right above the horizon, right a little bit below the horizon line, or you can just pull it down a little bit to pull it wherever you want the sky. And then press the check mark. Now we've applied our sky, and we're going to paint in this black layer box and with our paintbrush, and I'm going to use a lower opacity because I want the sky to be lighter, and we are painting with a white color, and this will paint on your sky. So go ahead and paint it on. And you can zoom in and make sure you get all the details here. I'm just going to do it really quick for the tutorial. Here you go, it's just a quick example. Um, you can also change the opacity of the actual sky layer. If you choose to paint with 100% opacity, you can do that too. You can also do the same thing, it will do the same process for you when you apply some Rana Sky Reflection and that is for in the water or windows or anything like that. And you can also blur your sky, but when you use these um, sky editor actions you have to actually click the layer of the sky and not the layer mask. So be sure you do that. You can blur, blur more, um, add sky contrast, darken, lighten, add moody skies, more color, warm up, cool down, and black and white. You can also use the tools here, zoom in, zoom out, um, fit on screen, flatten image, resize for web, web sharpening, and happily ever after. Very, very simple. You have lots of sky overlays to choose from. They're all bright and colorful. And I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. And if you have any questions at all, please visit me at samrana.com or you can email me at info at samrana.com. Thank you very much.